What? That's hard, bro. Warning. All stunts performed in this video were conducted by trained professionals in a safe, controlled environment. Do not try this at home. What's good, YouTube? Welcome back to another video, man. And today, we're going to switch it up just a little bit. So normally, you guys know that I do rating my subscribers guns. But today, we're going to switch over to a new series. It's going to be Cop or Drop. So basically, it's the same thing that we've been doing. But instead of me giving you a rating 1 through 10, I'm just going to simply tell you guys if I will cop your guns or if I'm going to drop them. So if you want to be featured in this series, all you have to do is DM me on Instagram. Send me your pictures and your videos of real guns, BB guns, airsoft, gel blasters, paintball, whatever you want to send me. I'm going to put it in the video and we're going to cop it or we're going to drop it. So let's get straight into it. All right. So first up, we got my boy right here. He got a Glock 45. He got the standard mag, the extended mag, and he got the drum mag, the drum ski. That's one thing that I need to get. I don't have an Evike drum mag that fits one of my Glocks. So that's real hard. He also got the laser and the flashlight. And he got the custom orange PS4 controller. Oh, but he don't got no stick cover on the controller. Like, bro, I peep, bro. Your controller, bro. You feel me? You need to get a little... You need to get these things. Put these things on your controller, the little grip pads. Because I know your thumb be hurting when you be trying to run. When you trying to run forward on Fortnite, the controller, like, it be cutting your thumb up probably. But, hey, that's hard. My boy got three magazines and he got the laser with the flashlight. So, you know what? You definitely getting a cop. I want to cop that loadout. You feel me? I got all these airsoft Glocks. But I don't have a drum mag for any of them yet. All I have is the extended mag for the Glock 18C. But I don't have a drum mag. So I'm definitely going to have to get that soon. I know everybody wants me to keep um, upgrading this Glock 18C. So the drum mag might be next for this 18C. We're going to find out. You got to wait and see what I do to my 18C. You feel me? But you definitely getting a cop. We starting off this video good, man. That's a, that's a cop. All right. So next up. Oh my god. My boy sent me a picture off Safari with water gun squirter. Water gun squirter. That's really what you looked up? You Googled that? You couldn't even just look up water gun? Like, why'd you have to put squirter at the end, bro? Come on. That was unnecessary. That squirter was unnecessary. But nah. We got the red. The blue. The light blue. The green. Nah, that top one might be pink. I think it's pink, blue, aqua and green that's like lime green and these are like the cheap 97 cent water guns bro they're finger blasters they're not even real guns like that red little trigger it's not doing nothing bro like i could spit on somebody harder than those guns squirt so you feel me i'd rather get a cup of water and just throw it on somebody than use those because that is not doing nothing you're getting hit with a fat drop this is the first drop of the copper drop series i'm dropping all four of those guns are trash like i said i'd rather flick water on somebody i'd rather get the hose and spray somebody this is garbage you feel me when you see these come out that's how you know i'm gonna keep it so real with you i'm not lying if your guns are trash you're getting a fat drop bro black af1 activities i'm not holding back from y'all we going straight into it next up ooh. We got the Glock 18C in the case. Looks real clean. We don't like seeing standard mags. We don't like seeing any magazine under 15. If you got the Glock 18C, you're going to have to put an extender or a drum on it because, hey, nobody's shooting full auto 15 shots. You feel me? We need at least 30 shots. But nah, he sent me another picture of it. Ooh, look like he did some upgrades. So he got the grip around that handle. Then he got a reflex sight on it as well. That thing look hard. And he also sent me a video, so punch it in. All right. Got the red dot sight with the beam on it. Think there's a flashlight, too. He's not showing us. Cut that flashlight on, my boy. There it is. Yes, sir. He heard me. All right. So I'm not going to lie. That the Oh, damn. Putting that flashlight in my face. Now I know how y'all be telling me don't put that flashlight in your face on my video and I be doing that. But hey, back to the last picture. He got the flashlight, 
with the reflex sight, with the grip. You feel me? No extended magazine. That's the only thing that I need you to do is get an extendo or maybe even a drum mag if you're feeling crazy. But you're getting hit with a cop, my boy. I'm definitely going to have to cop that. That build looks raw and um, looks real clean. So, yeah, just maybe upgrade the magazine. That's all I got to say. You feel me? That thing is hard. Hey, if you want to get a better light in a um, laser too, I would say switch over to an Olight instead of that one because I have seen that one on Amazon, but I know you guys don't want to spend a lot of money on your lights, but t trust me, bro, the upgrade is worth it. Olight has a better throw, so it's brighter, and it comes with a laser too, so it's the best of both worlds. It's definitely worth your money, and if anything, you guys are saying that these are expensive, but you can use them forever. Like They come with a charger, they're rechargeable, and they work on any of your pistols, so you can just keep switching them around and then when you get real firearms you can put them on those as well so I would say invest in the Olight it's definitely worth your money I have two of them as you can tell I got the tan one too they got different colors super duper bright and they come with the laser too like trust me bro Olight's worth it but you're still getting a cop without it but trust me like you feel me invest and if I see another person without an Olight they're getting a drop Nah, I'm playing, but like I'm just trying to give y'all some advice. Some people don't like Olight though. That's it's all about preference. So if you don't like that and you want to stick to your laser, go ahead, go ahead. It's just I like Olight. Hey, it is what it is, my boy. All right, next up we got a Glock 19 Gen 4. Um, he didn't really say too much. Here's another picture. He said he do got the glow in the dark sights though. Y'all see that right there? The glow in the dark sights. So. It, it basically is just a Glock 19, you feel me? You don't got no upgrades on it other than the glow in the dark sight. But it is a Gen 4, so... Is that enough to make me cop? Heck no, bro. That's a drop, my boy. I'm not gonna lie. Hey, Glock 19s are clean. Like, I love the Glock 19. But the only upgrade you have so far is a glow in the dark sight. Now, personally, for me, that wouldn't be enough for me to just copy. He also DM me that he has a blue beam coming in soon. So once that beam comes in, it definitely will switch over to a cop. But with just the glow in the dark sight, personally, I love Glock 19s, but that Glock 19X is my favorite. You feel me? If you had a 19X with glow in the dark sight, I might copy because that 19X just hit different, my boy. Next up, ooh, we got a 1911. That thing look crazy. Is that a tracer unit on there? I gotta watch it again. And he got the flashlight. What is that? Rose gold? I can't even tell what color that is. It looked black from one angle. Then it looked like brownish from one angle. Then it looked rose gold. And he got the babe colorway on there. And he got an iced out bracelet. Y'all see that bracelet, man? We peep your bracelet, my boy. That thing blinging. All right, so we got a video of it shooting. Ooh, he do got the um tracer unit on there. And how would a BB still glowing after they got shot out? He got glow in the dark BBs. What? That's hard, bro. Diamonds dancing and the BBs glowing in the dark. That's definitely a cop. Who would expect it? Everybody expected that. That's definitely a cop. That's on hard. I mean, just look at it. Like, if you're not copping that. I don't know what to say. And he got the glow in the dark BBs with a tracer unit, whatever. Like, that's just tough, my boy. Next up, what the? My boy got the 1600 Cowboy Revolver Shooter Musket Single Fire Stuff the Barrel Gunpowder Sheriff Pistol Revolver. What is that? Boy. He got this. This gun's been passed down for generations. He got this from his great, 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 great grandfather. What? I've never seen this thing in my life. This is single fire. Like, where do you load it up? This is the thing where you gotta, you gotta get the gun. Do that. Get the stick. Go like this, and then pull it back and shoot it. That reload time is ten minutes. Hey, I'm not gonna lie, it looked clean though, like, hey, you feel me? You could definitely grip that thing, like, you're gonna be holding it like this, 
that's how you're gonna be holding the pistol. Like, I mean, you're gonna be like, put your hand on there. Boom! You be sniping. I'm pretty sure this is the same gun that John Wilkes Booth used to assassinate President Abraham Lincoln in 1874. This is the same exact one. I've seen this on news before. I've seen this on Nat Geo. I studied this before. Hey, that's that's evidence, my boy. We got you. You got this passed on from your great grandfather, and your great grandfather got arrested for killing him. So, this is the murder weapon of great Abraham Lincoln, Big Abe. Uh, I'm gonna have to hit you with that drop, my boy. I like Abraham Lincoln. From what I've heard, you feel me? He was a decent president. I'm pretty sure he was like six foot seven, bro. He should have been playing basketball, but he always wore that big hat. Why he always wear a big hat? Like, what? What was that? He always liked to read books. Like, I might have the cop. Nah, I'm playing. Nah, that's it's still a drop. Like, you feel me? We rock with Abe on this channel, but nah, my boy, that's a drop. Get him out of here. Get him out of here. All right, next up, we got my boy right here with the Glock 18C. Got the nice flashlight on there, and he got the extendo. So you feel me? He already starting off good. Last person with the 18C didn't have the extendo. I don't know. You had to have the extendo. Like, I'm pretty sure the 18C come with extended mag. So I don't know, like, where you put it it, or, like, if you didn't put it in the video. But we need to see it because you can't have an 18C without an extendo. That's just law. All right, he also got a Glock 17. Whoa, whoa, whoa. My boy shooting in the air, bro. Chill, them BBs might come back down and hit somebody. Like, relax, bro, relax. You gotta shoot at a target. You can't just be busting in the air. You gonna shoot somebody eye out, bro. You gotta be safe. Or you might even hit a bird. You feel me? You never know what you can hit. So, guys, I don't condone shooting in the air. Like, it's very dangerous. But he got the same attachment on his 18C that he do on the 17, so I'm pretty sure he was just moving it around. But he also got a video of him shooting the 18C. Okay, there we go. He's shooting the full auto at the ground. So you feel me? He's not shooting in the sky. He's not going to hit no birds, no squirrels. And he's not going to land down and hit no kids. So that's what I like to see. And he also got that full auto with the extended mag. So that's hard right there. Hey, I'm going to have to hit you with a cop, my boy. Just make sure you're not shooting up in the sky. Next up, we got the gold scar. Oh, my gosh. My boy got the Nerf gold scar. 30 shots coming out that scar. You don't want to catch him in tilted towers. He going to build on you, jump up, hit you with that triple dink head shot. You out of there. Back to the lobby, my boy. Hey, that's definitely a cop. Hopping off the battle bus with that. I don't see how I'm going to lose, bro. Victory Royale every time. We saved the best for last. So we got the Block 19 right here. The Lego Glock. This thing's hard. I'm not going to lie to you. Straight up, like, I'm pretty sure this is like every kid's dream. Having a Lego Glock, it just looks satisfying. Looks aesthetic. And it's a Glock. Like, come on now. This is definitely a cop. A cop. A super cop. Hey. Like, what if you could actually build on top of it? Like, you got your own Legos, and you put stuff on top of that Glock. That would be hard. You gonna see me dumping the magazine and Lego Batman just on top, sliding back and forth like this? That thing will be lit, so I might have to cop that Lego Glock. That would be hard in the future. Maybe even a full auto, a full auto Lego Glock 18C. Imagine that. Let's make it happen, man. But, hey, that's gonna wrap up my first ever cop or drop with my subscribers guns make sure if you want to be in the next one dm me on instagram pictures videos whatever you can send slide it my way we're gonna punch you in my boy so i appreciate you guys for watching if you made it this far in the video i'm really rocking with you because not only are you watching my videos but you dedicating your whole time to watch from the beginning to the end so make sure you guys leave a fat like and a comment subscribe to my second channel eguap you feel me? I'm trying to run up 10K subscribers on my second channel and 200K on this channel. We're so close. I'm so grateful for every single one of you guys. Like, every single person. Every single person that watched my videos, even if you're not subscribed. I would really like it if you did subscribe. But, hey, every single person that watches my videos, I appreciate you. And make sure you come back next time. We got more bangers on the way. I'm going to catch y'all on my next video, man.
gel guns will rip 